for Our Andromeda by Brenda Shaughnessy. In his citation for Our Andromeda, Griffin Poetry Prize judge Mark Doty observes, Brenda Shaughnessy, in her third collection, continues to work the rich verbal surfaces and punning elusive textures that marked her previous work, but her art has been transformed by a galvanizing sense of necessity into a more riveting, sometimes fiercely direct consideration of what it is to love a child, to care for one whose ability to care for himself is profoundly limited. What Wallace Stevens called the pressure of reality has deepened and furthered the work of a poet whose early poems indeed might have come from the same well as Harmonium. Without losing her music, playfulness, or sass, Shaughnessy has established herself as a poet of breathtaking emotional depth. To read such clear, affirming song made out of love, grief, and danger is both devastating and uplifting at once. I want to say thank you to the Griffins, to the trustees, to the judges, to um, Ruth and June, for this, to everybody who made this possible, just for us to be here celebrating poetry. I'm so moved by what I'm hearing, and I'm so deeply honored to be here. So thank you. This poem is called Visitor. I am dreaming of a house just like this one, but larger and opener to the trees, nighter than day and higher than noon, and you, visiting, knocking to get in, hoping for icy milk or hot tea or whatever it is you like, for each night is a long drink in a short glass, a drink of black sound water, such a rush and fall of lonesome, no form can contain it. And if it isn't night yet, though I seem to recall that it is, then it is not for everyone. Did you receive my invitation? It is not for everyone. Please come to my house lit by leaf light. It's like a book with bright pages filled with flocks and glens and groves and overlooked by pan, that seductive satyr in whom the fish is also cooked. A book that took too long to read, but minutes to unread that is to forget. Strange are the pages thus, nothing but the hope of company. I made too much pie in expectation. I was hoping to sit with you in a tree house, in a nightgown, in a real way. Did you receive my invitation? Written in haste before leaf blinked out, before the idea fully formed. An idea like a storm cloud that does not spill or arrive, but moves silently in a direction like a dark book in a long life, with a vague hope in a wood house with an open door. 